Hey, brothers and sisters of Christ, y'all. I'm going to run something past y'all. Y'all know when God give me something, I got to give to y'all. Okay, let me run my notes. Okay, <clears throat> the Lord is showing me why, <clears throat> why a lot of Catholics and uh, you know how different forms of the Bible went out. Okay, let's go. Let me see. Let me see what the Lord had. Lord, give me to give it to me. How you want me to give it to you? I gotta explain it to y'all. Okay, now y'all know about the Book of Enoch. It was taken out the Bible, right? Cause um, there was hidden things, and the Book of Enoch's about like the angels, fallen angels, and all this. So that's why Enoch. They took Enoch out the Holy Bible. Some kind of way, you know, these demons back in the day, they didn't want that about them be notified with the Lord been telling us about. Uh, back in the days, these demons, the fallen angels, uh, when they came down, they started grabbing the territory on this and this and that. So they come up with all these religions. So they took the book of Enoch out because they didn't want nobody to know about them. Okay. Knowing they were sleeping with, um, sleeping with, um, uh, the, uh, when Noah, they were sleeping with, um, Human beings having sex with them, having kids and all this. So this was like in the Old Testament. So that's why they took the book of Enoch out. I'm giving to you what the Lord shared, shared with me. So everybody else started going. They started making the, giving the Bible because the Lord created the word. But they took out what they wanted to take out of it. So they took out Enoch out because they didn't want Satan. Nobody to know that Satan was cast out to the third of heaven. But God still put it in the Bible, and, you know, in the New Testament. Because all they had was the Old Testament. They, they That's what they, they had the Old Testament at first. Because, you know, um, then the New Testament, when Jesus came, he would die for our sins. So all they was going off is on the Old Testament. But they took Enoch out because they didn't want them to know about them, the demons, the fallen angels. And, you know, so this is why a lot of Catholics in Ethiopia got their own uh, Holy Bible, too. A lot of these, they go into Catholics to being a Catholic. Because a lot of these Catholics don't believe in the New Testament. They only believe in the Old Testament. They don't believe in Jesus Christ. They was taught back then that Jesus Christ was evil. Okay? That's why a lot of them don't like Jesus. Because the fallen angels took out the book of Enoch. So they wanted people to turn against God. So this was they was preaching to the people of the Old Testament. I'm giving this to you what the Lord gave it to me. The Old Testament. So they started giving the Catholics. Had them have over the world talking about against against the word, you know, uh, the most high. Because he cast them down out of heaven. So they started making Enoch the book. The Lord had them to write the book of Enoch, but they hid it and took it away. So that's why later on the Lord gave Enoch back in the word in New Testament. Okay. So, and they don't believe in the Old Testament, I mean the New Testament. That's why they believe in Moses. They don't believe in Jesus. That's why they feel like they, um, Jesus is just a prophet sin. Because all they're thinking is just Moses as they lead him. That's why Pope Francis, on that video I showed you, he worshiping Moses. They don't, they don't believe in Jesus. Because Jesus was in the New Testament. So, um, so when the New Testament came and the Lord, <laughs> they had the New Testament, Jesus Christ came. So they don't believe in Jesus. They don't believe Jesus came to save the day. They start playing God. Cause this, this is what it is. So, reason only reason we know about the book of Enoch, cause it came in Jude, one fourteen. The Lord gave us Jude this morning. Look how the Lord worked. I'm telling y'all. So the word, the Lord gave us a book, a Jude this morning, talking about Enoch. When he's talking about the apocalypse, so he revealed things to us, y'all. That's why they mad. But well, let's go to Jude, fifteen oh three. So that's why, y'all, and that's why the Lord say these generations, this generation, generation, bringing up. This how people was brought up. The people that were so sensitive about they Catholic with the Pope. Because people, this generation, these demons had these people thinking this. Following the Old Testament. They've been, this go way back with our ancestors. People, ancestors, they got all colors. Black, it don't matter. All of them, you, you believe in. And then it's some people. Uh, so Catholic is all colors. It don't matter. They follow Catholic. They go with the Old Testament, which is against God. They think Moses is they is they God, and then they take place thinking they Jesus, the New Testament. So it's that's why I say it's good and bad. That's why the Orthodox, some of the Orthodox priests, remember he was uh, telling Catholic, telling uh, Pope that he need to repent, cause some do believe in the New Testament, the Old Testament, cause when the thing is they did their Bible study and they knew Enoch, the the book of Enoch had to be existed, cause it's in Jude in the New Testament. That's why. Y'all got to get in y'all word. So, some do believe. That's why I say it's good and bad. So, 
This is what the thing is, people falling into different religions, how they were raised, some still going off into the world. <coughs> so the Lord is pressing to why, why they, they're against Jesus. They don't believe in Jesus because they in the Old Testament. In the book of Enoch, the demons, the uh, fallen angels took it, <coughs> took it away. The book of the Bible took Enoch away because they know it was going to it was gonna, uh, expose them. But God still allowed the prophets and them still put them in there to tell you what it was about in the New Testament. But people don't believe, don't read they whole, they don't believe in the whole Bible. That's what God said. You can't have one without the other. You gotta have the first testament, you, uh, old testament and the new testament. So he gave us Jude. And that's when they're talking about Enoch. So some people believe in the whole Bible. This why. So this is what the Lord given to me, y'all, right now. If we get to Jude 15, y'all bear with me. But the Lord gave us Jude this morning. We were talking about the populace. He was telling about the fivefold ministry. Because these people fall into stuff like this. They get into greed and everything. They just like these demons. These fallen angels. They all about greed and money. They follow these. Get into the word of the Lord. Then all of a sudden they get into uh <coughs> get into uh Satan. Because half of them don't even believe in this. That's why you gotta care who you believe who you follow. Because everybody don't believe the whole Bible. They only believe the the Old Testament. So they take place and think Jesus is evil. That's how they was back in the day, way back in the biblical days. I'm, the Lord giving this to me now. So, and he said, Enoch. Demons and took the book out of Enoch, took it out. Because they don't want nobody to know about them demons. They're following them, but God still put it in them. With no, knowing the demons was in the flood, and then put it, um, but they, you know, they ain't want nobody to know about that. Because <coughs> they took that out. That's the only way you know about the demons in the flood of Enoch. I mean, with uh, Noah, you reading about Enoch. But also, right here, Enoch is in Jude. The Lord still put it in there so people can know about these demons. Y'all, that's why I say we got to expect to be persecuted, but I don't care. I'm going to preach the word of the Lord. Don't nothing fear me. God is with me. They, they want you to destroy the truth. Okay, here go book of Jude. 1 through 14. Let's read this. The Lord gave us Jude this morning. Talking about the apocalypse. Told us about um, the sevenfold ministry and all that. He got all Jude in there too. About our faith. <coughs> Jude, a bona fide, uh, look, Jude, a bona, bona servant of Jesus Christ and a brother of James. This is why the Lord said he kept on stressing Jesus Christ throughout the Bible. Because people want to take him out of it. Because that's what the demons did. They, they, they just want people to believe in the Old Testament. To those who are called, sanctified by God the Father and preserved in Jesus Christ, mercy and peace and love be multi multiplied to you. Beloved, while I was very diligent to write to you concerning our com common salvation, I found it necessary to write to you, exhorting to you to contend earnestly to the with, for the faith, which was given to, for all delivery to deliver to the saints. For certain men have crept in unnoticed, okay, who long ago were marked out by this condemnation, ungodly men who turned the grace of God into lewdness and denied the Lord God and, our, and our, uh, the Lord Jesus Christ. At the first beginning, the Old Testament, these demons, these demons came, these fallen angels had people, these demons, and had people uh, go on traditional, bring us down, took the first, these are men that <coughs> crept in, took the Enoch out, that's why they ain't in there, because they don't want you to know about all that's going on with Enoch, them demons, all the secrets and stuff, they don't want you to know, the laying over people, kids, all, laying over marrying women, having sex with people, fallen demons, remember what the Lord telling us now. So they wanted to do only the Old Testament because Jesus, the Lord sent Jesus. Remember God said he sent his help to the people because all this stuff was going on at first. Send Jesus to save the day. They got jealous because they already, they was head over it. Wasn't no Jesus to save the day. They were running the world and then the Lord Most High sent help, Jesus Christ. So now they taking Jesus out because they only believe in the Old Testament. So now they want to be, they want to be Jesus. They the priests, they the royal hood, this and this and that. They lead the world. And that's why God say irresponsible shepherds. These people get into the word. And then later on, they into something else. Okay, let's go. Okay, Jesus Christ. But I want to remind you, though you once knew this, that the Lord having saved the people out of the land of Egypt, afterward destroyed those who did not believe. He Remember he took Moses. Red Sea took the people out. The one Pharaoh on them, he destroyed them. Old Testament. They did not believe, and the angels who did not keep their prophets, proper domain, the fallen angels, them demons, 
they start going into doing other things. Cast down, they, they start, these, these angels, these demons start doing everything. Lost their proper domain because they was in heaven with the Lord, with the Most High. But they got up there with Lucifer, cast them down from their position. Now, they trying to run earth, heaven, I mean, hell on earth. They've been doing this what the Lord said. It's been way before our time. But they took the book of Enoch out because they want you to know what's going on. Um, hold on. And the angels who did not keep their proper domain, but left their own adult, and he was reserved in everlasting chains under darkness in the judgment of the great day, as Sodom and Gomorrah and the cities around them in similar manner of these, having, having given to themselves over the sexual immorality and gone after strange flesh, flesh or set forth as an example of suffering and vengeance unto uh, eternal life. Yeah, they came down having sex, sexual immor immorality. That's why some of these priests and these, these uh, irresponsible shepherds in them, the ministers, the father, they mess with the kids. They mess, they, they all about sex. They don't care who they get it from. You, kids, everything. They, they have fornication, lust. These people don't have the heart of the Lord. You got some good ones and you got some bad ones. Some of them, they follow the whole testament. Obey to God's law, the whole Holy Bible. But some, they don't believe in the New Testament. They think in the Old Testament, they, uh, think the Most High is, uh, they, they think um, the Old Testament, God being evil. Because it's what they said. So when you hear the Lord still had it now by Enoch, sexual morality, gone off a strange fest, set forth the example, suffering and vengeance of, <coughs> of eternal fire, the bottomless pit. Even though some still run out here, but majority of them in the bottomless pit. That's why them Jezebel spirits and all them and all that sexual, all, everything. That LGBTQ, they got all that, but that's what I'm saying, sexuality. Likewise, also the dreamers defile the flesh, rejecting authority and speak evil of dignitaries. Yet Michael, the angel, Michael, the mark angel, and contending with the devil, when he disputed about the body of Moses, dare not bring against him a reviling accusation, but said, the Lord rebuke you. Because they wanted, Michael came down. They tried to, no, he ain't in the mix of that. I rebuke you. That's why you have to, it's, it's angels. Uh, good, good angels. Fallen angels. They fighting. The Lord got them fighting for us. He fighting. But it's good against bad. But these are fallen angels with their demons. Like God got his kids. The Most High got his, gave his son Jesus Christ. The Holy Spirit resided in us, which we become a kid. Like the spirit in them, demons. You get it? That's why it come with demons. It need, a, it, need a, <laughs> it need a body to resist in. Demons. Why are you casting out demons? Because evilness. Satan and what spirit he give them. Ain't no spirit. Number demons. The Lord got, the Most High got his son Jesus Christ. Give us the Holy Spirit. So I'm giving it to you like the Lord give us. So that's why angels, they got on the demons. Casting in all, Satan got his demons. <coughs> Satan giving the little spirit to, to <coughs> these fallen angels. That was God say, don't worship no, idolize no angels. He put, that's why the angels mad, them fallen angels. Because God gave Jesus Christ authority over them. They don't believe in the New Testament. They giving their spirit of demons into people. God give you the Holy Spirit. That's why he said these people, these fivefold ministry, these false, false leaders and teachers and all that stuff, the false witness and false prophets. Yeah, because they demon possessed. They, they, they don't believe they don't believe in the, um that Jesus Christ the New Testament. They believe in the Old Testament. And people fall victim to this because they taught man taught this. Generational gone down, curses and strongholds and all this, they fall into this. And Satan, they people are blind, and the blind leading the blind to the ditch. But also some people just they lost. They know the Lord and they lost trying to find their way, but God bringing his people back. And whoever all out there gonna stay. So I'm giving to you what God giving to me right now, y'all. Okay, so the Lord rebuke you, but these speak evil, whatever they do not know, and whatever they know naturally, like butte priests, in these, in these things they corrupt themselves. Woe to them, for they have gone into the way of Cain, have run greatly into error of Balaam to profit and perish the rebellion of Korah. That's why the Lord say, what, what is ba uh, who worship uh, <coughs> Balaam? He's talking about the compromising church. Because people knew the word of the Lord, they, they believe half of the Bible, they don't believe all of it. Because they, they want to take place of that New Testament. Jesus Christ. And people following these folks. And half of them, that's just that they, that, that's what they into. Because they were brought up with their family. But God revealing veils from their faces. That's why Satan trying to have his, his uh, earth on heaven. I mean, Satan, I rebuke you. Satan trying to have his, uh, his world on earth. 
when God already gave it to us. It been happening way before our time. That's what the Lord said. And they took out the book of Enoch. They didn't want you to know about it. But God still made a way to put it in there. Had you to talk about it. So that's what the thing is. And, and it makes sense because you know how God put people in your life just saying, run across people? I have three Catholic people that I ran, to, ran into. My first one, <laughs> what I call like my sister. She's an older lady. She told me that when she was a Catholic, she found Jesus Christ. Her family disowned her. Okay? Because she ain't going to their religion. Because they don't believe in the New Testament. They only believe in the Old Testament. Then I ran into another a co-worker. One co-worker. Ex-co-worker. Said that she was into Catholic and stuff like that. And end up they, they priest. Or the Pope of them. Or whoever was messing with them. He was on the news. Having, messing around with little kids. Having sexual immorality in, into the uh, church. Into the uh, synagogue. But the synagogue for church too. Because we have that all in baptism, church, everything. All them people. The church. The Lord talking about the seven churches. Then I met another one. A co-worker said that. Her, she was telling me that she, when she go to sleep, she felt like somebody watching her. I said, yeah, it might be a monitoring spirit because I was trying to tell her something because what God taught me. She said, um, my dad told me, not the, my auntie told me about that, but my daddy told me that my auntie is a evil. She a witch, so don't even listen to her because they don't want her to know the truth because that's how her daddy was brought up. They think Jesus Christ is evil. So how you going to do miracle signs and wonders with the Lord and um, you, ain't got, you don't believe in the Father, the Son, and get the Holy Spirit. Because they got their own false stuff. Doing witchcraft. Making their own signs and wonders. Because Satan got his own stuff. So the Lord just gave this to me. And I had to give it to y'all. Y'all be blessing Jesus name. Knowing things that never be the same. That's why God said you got to tell. Ask people who they who they, uh, who they they serve. And they say Jesus Christ is the son of God. Because people don't believe in Jesus Christ. The Lord steady telling us y'all. God is good all the time. When he tell me something I'm going to reveal it to y'all. Y'all be blessed in Jesus' name, knowing things will never be the same. Worship, glorify His holy name, Jesus Christ.